Hey guys, today we're going to show you how to change the database name in MySQL. So say if you have a database and you want to change the name for that database. So you, you can't just, there, there's no direct rename database command. So what, what you need to do is uh, create a new database and you're going to dump your old database, basically backing up the old database. And then you're going to restore the, the new database the you're going to restore your old database to the new database name and then you're going to delete the old one right so we also let's say we have some databases here show databases now you, you have a database called test db1 let's say we want to call it test db2 right so create data base test db2 right now show databases and we see we have test db1 test db2 right now let's exit out of here and let's say my sql dump and we're going to specify test db1 and we're going to say backup uh, sql there we go backed it up now let's restore it, my SQL, oops, MySQL, and we are going to say test db2. And remember, you have to have created the, the new database before you can restore to it. So we're going to say backup.sql, run this, and now let's jump back into the MySQL CLI, show databases, and drop database, oops, <coughs> can't type tonight, um, test db1. So we're gonna drop the old database and just verify that it, it has in fact been dropped. So now we only have that new database. So let's use it just to verify that it has the data. So use test db2. Now show tables. We can see it has some tables there. Now this is a brand new database that I just created. So we know there was nothing in it before. So we can see these tables are here. These are the tables that we brought over from the old database, right? So we can say uh, select all from food and yeah type of that again all right there we go we can see the data is there right so that's how we renamed the it's kind of a roundabout solution but that's what you would do if you wanted to rename a database so what we did we took test db1 we we created test db2 we backed up test db1 we stored it to test db2 and we deleted test db1, right? So that's our roundabout solution. That's how you would, uh, that's how you um, change the name of a database in MySQL. So hopefully someone finds this useful. You might want to give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below if you know something I don't know. And probably want to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell icon. A lot of stuff you don't want to miss out on. We cover, we're going to be covering more database stuff, um, a lot of coding, servers, um, hardware, software, all sorts of great stuff, 3D printing, Raspberry Pis, all sorts of interesting things you want in your YouTube feed. So, you know, definitely subscribe. And uh, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys on that next video.